the project it has been absolutely an amazing experience from from the beginning to to right now every time it has been like christmas day really it's all the time all the location was just so it's unbelievable like i mean i never never have any experiences like this so it's uh, it's great i have amazing time Chloe, it's a it's a French girl which um, which bred and born in in France, but um, decided to in my story to went to London uh, to be a veterinarian, and uh, that's why she speaks English. Uh, but the thing is, um, in 1940, when the war started, she received a letter from her mom saying that the German is arriving to the village, and she decided to stop everything and going back to help her family. And it has been four years that she's trying to be here for her brother and surviving by the war and everything. So when she met the American, maybe thanks to them, she will have the relief that she really, really hoping for the last four years. Everything has happened to her family, to the people around her. All her life has been disappeared. So she has no more people that she can just, you know, just put her head down and cry and say, I'm scared or anything. Because I put her like kind of a lion, which is going to be very... If she don't know you, now she don't trust anyone anymore. So she will be very... No, I don't know you. You're going to have to own my trust if you want to do something. But thing is, she met boys. at boys and she can... For the first time for the last four years, she can feel that he was really want to help her. So he gonna give her some courage as well. At the beginning, I couldn't really understand what they were saying. The accent was so strong, but uh, no, it is, they are great. They are all very, very supportive. And the fact that I was the only girl, because they've all got very amazing experience and they was very helpful. And uh, no, it was, yeah, it was fun. They went to boot camp, so when we met them, they already know how to do the patrol and like walk in the forest with a gun. And then when the prep, we went to a stage like this and uh, we was like practicing for the gun. And the first time that I used M41, I was like, oh, uh, okay. And just like, oh my gosh, what is this? Okay, I'm going to have to work three times more to be, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Chloe is not it's not it's not an action girl at all. Like she never she never did that. She never touched a gun before. She she she's not an she's just a normal girl. She's a 22, 23 years old girl which grew up in France and that happened to her. She's in the middle of the war but she's happened to her and she has to deal with it. But she yeah, she's fight her. She's got fire on her. <laughs> the first time I went to see the laboratory set. I couldn't. I couldn't realize like what what was it in front of me because all the detail was just so perfect. Everything was just so absolutely amazing. You've got already that which is wow. Well, I'm gonna try to be in the same level because it's just so yeah. It's make our job so much easy. That's for sure. I think he's great because he knows what he's doing and he has got great idea about shots. And what I really appreciate is uh, when we're on set and until he's not satisfied about his shot, it will push you until he gets what he wants, which I think is very, very cool and very important as well. I think he's, he's a great director as well. He's, he's a nice guy too, so it's, uh, no, no, it's cool. Since I'm a baby, I, I grew up with J.J. Abrams film, so be part of it, it's, and have the chance to meet him is also very, yeah, he, he's a lovely, he's a very lovely man, and it's, uh, it's amazing, yeah, it's like, it's like you imagine your big, like, figure and, like, uh, producer or director have, you've been growing up with, and it's finally he's talking to you and saying, Oh, it's good. You're doing a good job, and you're like, oh, thank you, and you're like, oh my gosh. <laughs> I think this film is going to be a a cool, a good mix in between science fiction and realistic drama. I think the audience that I hope 
I hope the audience will feel connected about the character and people and yeah. So I think yeah, that thing it's gonna be it's gonna be a good mix in between action, scary, but in the same time real person who's got real feeling because the first thing Julius was saying they're real people. 